bitch. It is what it is. This some five star dick. She a big gold freak. It's a must. Hey y'all. So it's Anna back with another video. I'm in the kitchen. Um, it's super cold out here. It's raining and cold. Um, I got the oven on because it's really cold. So I'm trying to keep up the kitchen clothes and warm. Um, I wanted some cake, so I decided to do like a little cake pop. Um, because I have a cake pop maker, so I decided to try it out and see how it goes. You know, I got my batter right here, and I got my little cake pop maker and my tools that I need. So let's see how that goes. And they also come with um, the directions, of course, and the cake pop sticks. So I'm gonna try it out, and if it works, then I might be using it in the future. So let's see how it is. This is what they're looking like. I just did some at a time just because I don't want to burn them all because it gets really hot so fast. And I'm only using this little measuring spoon right here. It's one tablespoon and just fill it up. But even one tablespoon gets it real full. So you might want to use a half a tablespoon. Um, yeah, a half tablespoon, and it's probably like perfect. But one tablespoon is a little bit too much. But you have to hurry up because, like I said, the plates are really hot, and it cooks like the bottom will cook super fast, but the top. Takes right Hey y'all, so I finally finished doing the cake pops. This is how they came out. They made a lot. Um, I was going to melt some chocolate and some walnuts, like coat them with walnuts, but my mom said just like this. Um, the cake maker decoration, the, the cake maker instructions um, has some recipes in it too. And I got this cake maker when I was at Hobby Lobby in San Marcos. <laughs> and this is how, you know. You know. It came with some more ingredients, um, some more instructions. So yeah. Talk to y'all later.